Welcome to the Concord Police Department Call Center. This call is being recorded. If you have an emergency, <laughs> press 1 now. For non-emergency matters, press 0 or remain on the line. If you know your party's extension, press it at any time. For upcoming community events, press 2. For the parking division, yeah, press 3. For police reports or firearm permits, press 4. Inquiries for police officers for detail or special event, press 5. Inquiries about employment opportunities, press 6. To provide an anonymous tip about criminal activity, call the Concord Regional Crime Line at 603-226-3100. To hear these options again, press 9. Thank you for letting us be of assistance to you. Please hold on while I try that extension. Uh, yeah, I saw a video where a cop gave a kid uh, two packs of cigarettes for his ID. If I fax you my ID, will you send me some cigarettes? No. No. Is that normal practice, though? Like, if I'm there um, and they want my ID, if, if I will they give me cigarettes if I give it to them? No. Nope. Man. It, okay. Is, is, that, is that okay? I mean, do you mind if your officers do that? I don't know. That's not normal. I don't know why they would do that, but I don't know what you mean by they would give them the Ah, uh, okay. Oh, you probably haven't seen it yet. You probably haven't seen it yet. I'm not, and I'm seriously not being rude. I mean this. On, I mean this honestly. You'll see the video. There's a guy outside your apartment right now. I'm finding a complaint, but um, it, yeah, there's 600 of us watching it now. But then there's a video from I guess it was probably last night, maybe. Again, you'll become aware of this pretty quick. Um, and okay. yeah, and, and again, you know who the officer was or no? Uh, if I back this up, this live stream, he does. The, a gentleman, uh, officer, just walked in the building just now, and he seemed to write down the officer's name on his notepad. He said he was writing it down, and he, he's inside the department right this minute. Um, so it's you know, yeah. It, it, again, I if I think you'll get it if you have my number on caller ID. We're both recording, and if you have my number on caller ID, if you don't find out what officer it is please call me because i can get it for you i just heard it like five minutes ago yeah. and so yeah, um, yeah. i suspect it's a officer uh or was it officer or lieutenant that took it do you know uh it was an officer and he actually um it was a, a it was a loitering report and the the, the quote-unquote suspect told him why he why he was there and he was willing to and he said I, I, he was in pain so he sat down to rest for 30 seconds and he said i'll move along and the officer said if you don't give me your id you're gonna get arrested so he threatened him with arrest to, you know, to surrender his Fourth Amendment, and then when the kid still didn't do it, and I, we're, we're going to find out if he's 18 or not. He may not be 18, which would be another problem, but, but for sure the cop threatened him with arrest um, if he didn't provide his ID, and then he offered him two packs of cigarettes um, to give him his ID. Yeah, and, yeah, he, gave, and he gave I mean, it to him. It's not normal practice, but I don't really, I don't know anything about it, unfortunately. I haven't seen such a thing. Yeah, yeah, I, yeah, I wouldn't expect it. You know, and, and, and as you know, I mean, everyone likes to talk about bad apples, um, but they always forget that, that that saying goes, a few bad apples spoils the whole bunch. So, like, all the apples there that are not spoiled, if they don't get rid of the bad apple, then everyone becomes spoiled. You know what I mean? Yep. That, that, that's that phrase, right? Yeah. So, again, like everyone I know who might call and follow up, well, you know, we want to be polite, you know, and I was kind of joking about getting cigarettes, but I would give you my ID for two packs of smokes, you know, not under threat of arrest, you know, but yeah, we just, you know, obviously, I, I, you guys should be aware, but it, do you have my number on caller ID? Or I'll, or I'll give it to you. Uh, I do 678 number? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Yep. No, I I absolutely do, and I can pass it on to the supervisor. Yeah. Yeah. Tell him. You know. Again, you can call me anytime he wants, or he or she. Um, mainly, if if they don't know who the officer is, then please definitely yeah. call me back so that I can give the name. Okay. All right. Sounds good. Thanks so much. Okay. Thank you. Bye. -bye. Bye, -bye.